yeah people welcome to my channel today we're going to talk about another sweet thing we're talking about going higher going higher in our investments we're going to talk about buying off houses how do you go about buying houses you've been calling me and asking me i want to buy house but these houses that you are showing me are damn too expensive how can somebody buy this kind of house they are showing me i want a cheap house that i can afford like um, 10 million 20 million today i'm going to address this matter once for all so that when you want to buy a house you know what to buy and where to buy it and how to buy it isn't that beautiful now let's talk about um, where to buy house when we talk of house we're talking about a property on top of the earth because the law says that the owner of the land is also the owner of any property on top of that land. So, if you want to buy a house, buy a house that you can claim as your own tomorrow. Do not buy a house that is on top of a shaky ground as it were. Buy a house that ha the land has documents. Otherwise, you will buy a house and another person has the land. So when you now sit in your house, the owner of the land will come and say, my friend, get out of my place, get out of my land. And you say, what? This is my house. What are you talking about? When two of you drag yourself to the law court, you know what will happen? The law will say, the owner of the land is the owner of the house. And there you go, you lose. But that is not going to happen after this lecture. So when you want to buy a house, make sure that the land on which the house is situated is your own. How do, does that happen? Make sure that the document of the land itself is bearing your name. Make sure, do make sure. And how do you do that? You try to get a certificate of occupancy bearing your name. If the, uh, if the person that abused the house has a certificate of occupancy of the ground before building the house good and fine you, would, uh, you and the person will go to the law and change it by collecting a governor's concept on you owning this land that they have already given to the previous owner do you get me you and your owner of the land will go and uh, um, upgrade the document to have a governor's consent now the governor has consented that this land that belongs to this person which to have given authority of your own has now become your own when you do that then the house on it is also your own nobody can drag it tomorrow please take note of this part oh. take note of this fact oh. i do not want to be hearing cases of ah i put something here now they say it's not my own now we are we don't know what to do it, they, i was duped i was scammed open your eyes and learn the fact right now now secondly if you want to buy a house buy a house that has quality you hmm? buy a house that has quality buy a well-built modern house do not buy an old rickety house that the inside is cracking. Buy new house. And the best way to buy new house is to buy into our off-plan projects. We have off-plan projects. That is, you pay us money. We use our team of engineers, quality engineers, and build the house for you. And then that comes brings us to the third point. That is the area of you paying for that house. Suppose that house is 80 million. And your salary is one million, or your salary is five hundred thousand. How are you going to get a house of eighty million? First of all, a house of eighty million will, def will definitely ask you of installment um, initial deposit of ten million, or as the case may be, less. Okay, so just look for money, rally round, look for money, fish that initial deposit, and then start paying on monthly basis. If you can't meet up in one year, don't worry. Nobody is collecting your house from you. Just make sure you, you discuss with the, the estate uh, developer. Say, please, uh, I can't meet up with one year. How many percentage will I add to extend this my payment to two years? When there is agreement, there is always peace. 
is when you will you, you you hang hang you hide behind your payment that they will start threatening you that they will deduct 40 percent of your of your of your payment and then boss no when you discuss with them you can discuss through me that's my work i will discuss with you developer say i can only finish up this payment in two years please help me and i'll pay you interest then you do that just struggle all those extra meat all those extra outings that you used to go just streamline yourself within that period and make sure you pay up your money when you pay up your money you'll be the one to call me and say well, come let's go and have a glass of wine and rejoice that this investment came through and it's because of your encouragement that is what a lot of people have done today remember there are many things that make people spend their money there are unforeseen occurrences that come up a friend may call you ah my brother my sister my father is dying please borrow me money so if you go ahead to collect loan to help their friends in their needs is it not true then sickness might strike death might strike in the family you see yourself vomiting out money that you never thought you can vomit but then when it comes to investing on your own you now start giving excuses ah it's too heavy i can't do it ah how are they getting their own money my own money i sweat for it it's hard for me it's not true if you put your mind on a project believe me you will surely scale through it's only when you have not put your mind in a project that it will be looking like a mountain so start today plan first thing first make arrangements save some money up money like five to ten million keep it then look for property a house a new house especially off plan houses because they allow you to pay on installments but if you're a big boy or you're a big girl you have money you have saved up reasonable money in your account you have 100 or 200 in your account well good and fine you can buy a two bedrooms um terrace building like the one you're seeing on the screen they are usually cheaper you can buy a three bedrooms terrace or you can buy uh, a detached fully detached house or you can buy a fully detached duplex when you say fully detached duplex that means it is standing on its own duplex standing on its own in an estate let it be yours so that you look back and say yes i worked hard when i was working i made use of my money i didn't make mistakes so i'm going to see you very soon talk to me let's start planning talk to me let's start working it out it is very very possible you own a house that dream house you had if you didn't dream about it that's a different thing because you have dreamt about it you see yourself in that house great realities start with a dream and you can make it if i'm here today in this house from a one-room apartment i'm here today in this house this whole house then your own case can never be a disappointment see you soon holy bridge homes you can send me a message or you can discuss with me on the number you see on your screen see you at the top soon